connecting the GND pin of the Arduino Nano to the ground line of the breadboard. Then I take another jumper wire and connect five volts from the Arduino Nano's 5V pin to pin number two of the tactile switch. After that, I connect another jumper wire from pin one of the tactile switch to the resistor going to the LED. After powering on, the LED turns on directly. This is because pins one and two are internally connected. So I move the jumper to pins one and four. Now the switch works properly and controls the LED on and off. I shifted the jumper wire to pins one and three. This also works perfectly. The LED is still controlled when I press the button. The switch works properly and controls the LED on and off. Next, I tried connecting the wire to pins two and four, and this combination also controls the LED. Finally, I connected the wires to pins three and four. These two pins are internally connected just like pins one and then I connected the pins three and two, which works the same as the one and four combination. And that's it.